The state of Florida is now taking legal action against Viva Recycling. In an Action News Jax investigation last July, we reported that hundreds of thousands of spare tires there were becoming a fire hazard and a ripe environment for mosquitoes to breed. Around the woods back there, they're bad. Roger and Pat Smith live a couple of blocks away and tell me mosquito control is in their neighborhood multiple times per week. I showed them the latest documents filed by the Florida DEP to try and stop operations at Viva. It's a real concern of mine. I think that uh, they should clean up their act. New court documents detail a trail of broken promises from Viva, with the company saying it was going to clean up the property and then not doing so. One consent order bound Viva to clean up the tires by July 1st, 2015. More than three years later, the company continues to operate without a permit. On Monday, we saw employees working with mounds of shredded tires in the background. I see you guys are still operating. Private property, get on the yard. After leaving the property, I called Viva. So I was wondering if I could speak with the manager on site, but employees wouldn't give me the manager's contact information or even his name. Then an employee pulled up to the front gate to block our view of the tires, nearly hitting my photographer in the process. Sir, are you concerned about the health risks the state has outlined here? No answers to our questions, but following the state's filing, Viva has a court date coming up in September. Kevin Clark, Fox 30, Action News Jax.